hey guys welcome back to my channel so today I'm gonna be doing an update makeup routine and I know it wasn't that long time ago but the makeups that I use and the routine that I used to do it did change a lot so I wanted to give you guys a little update and I feel like I do my makeup so much better even though it was like a couple of months I think it's a couple of months yeah I think so so if you guys want to see how I do my everyday makeup, then let's get started. I'm going to be using my Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. And it looks like this. And I've been really liking this. I like how it makes my um, skin look. So I'm just going to... It just smooths, smooths my skin. And next, I'm gonna be using my Benefit Professional Primer because I have a lot of pores in my nose. So I'm just gonna use a little bit. I'm putting it in my, like in my T zone. Because I feel like it also mattifies my, my skin. So that's where I, Put in my teaser. For I usually, I usually use foundations even my in my everyday, but I don't like putting a lot. That's why I don't mind. There's some people who love full coverage. So yeah, like I don't really mind if I don't have full coverage. Since I hate, I don't I I hate full coverage. So I just like putting like a little bit only where I have. Like my breakouts, so it's mostly here, here, my forehead, and my nose, just to even out my my skin tone. So I'm just gonna blend it out. And if I need more, I just I still have some in the back of my hand and I put it in my I put it in with my beauty blender. Just blending. I I like light um coverage. Like even though I have pimples and stuff, like I don't mind if it shows. I just want them like I just want the redness to cancel out, you know. So that's what I do. For concealer, I'm gonna be using my Tarte Shape Tape, and with concealer, I do want a full full coverage because for under my eyes, so I just I don't like to put a lot. I just go like that because this like this concealer goes a long way. So I'm just gonna blend it out. Like, I like to also put it in my eyelids. Next, I'm going to be using my Revolution Banana Powder. And I usually just, I'm going to put it on top of here because this is the only thing I don't like is the packaging i use the flat side of the of the beauty blender and i'm just gonna press in the powder just to set everything and my beauty blender is damp so i feel like I like to put this all over my face. I've noticed that when you press in the powder, I, I feel like your face looks so smooth. I used to use a brush and I'll just go like, just um putting all over my face. And I've noticed that my face looks so powdery. I mean, 
your face is gonna look powdery but i feel like like this not as much and your face looks so smooth so i recommend you um press it in the powder so that's how our face looks right now i forgot i did my eyebrows off camera because it takes so long to do my eyebrows so i'm just going to set them i use the benefit 24 hour um setter it's the best and for my eyebrows i just use the elf pomade i mean it's not pomade it's elf black on liner brow and Lock on liner brow and cream and it's in shade medium brown. I love this. I'm bringing a bronze to the face and I'm gonna be using the Clinique True True Bronzer Press Powder in shade 2 Sunkiss. Just like see a little bit. I love this bronzer. I'm gonna be using the Anastasia, Anastasia, Anastasia blush kit, and I'm gonna be using um, coastline. Wait, I'm gonna be mixing these two right there. It's just so pigmented. I just like to put very little. So next, I'm going to be setting my base with the Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray. Uh, I, I usually do this um, before applying my highlighter because I feel like it makes it even more blinding. And I love highlighters. So. I'm going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills and Amrezy. And that's my favorite, favorite part. to smile so so when I smile you could see the highlighter and there and I like to also put it in the tip of my nose and like this too my cupid's bow okay so i'm gonna be setting my face one more time with the urban decay all matter spray just to set everything next i'm gonna be doing my eyelashes and i i don't know why but i always like setting my face and then i do my eyelashes i feel like with the water i think it weighs them down i don't know i don't know if it's just me okay now curl my eyelashes. I'm gonna prime my eye my lashes with the next big and loud um, lash primer. Benefit Roller Lash Mascara. So 
some highlighter in the inner corners because since I don't really put eyeshadow but I feel like this opens up my eyes a lot so there so I'm gonna go in with a nude liquid lipstick and the one that I'm gonna be using is the BH Cosmetics liquid lipstick I'm not sure what shade it is um but we're just gonna go in So that's the completed look this is how I do my everyday makeup and it's simple I don't like to put on a lot of from um, makeup and it's actually good for summer too I mean it's summer's coming up and I mean you don't want to have um, loads of makeup and it's over here in Texas it's so so hot so that's why I mean first I don't like bring um, a lot of makeup because I feel like my face looks so cakey second it's so hot here at Texas so that's why I don't use makeup a lot of makeup so if you guys have any um, video ideas comment down below I'll, I'll really really appreciate it because I'm kind of like I kind of don't know what um, videos to film so yeah So, don't forget if you guys like this type of video then give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hit that bell button to be notified whenever I upload videos because I know you don't want to miss my videos I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in the next video bye